Hi, let's solve one previous question of grid technique. This question was asked in GATE CS 2016 set 1 question number 40. G equals to V E V for vertices E for edges is an undirected simple graph in which each edge has a distinct width and E is a particular edge of G. Which of the following statement about menu spanning tree MST of G is or are true? Two statements are given and four options are given. Let's check one by one statement. First statement, if E is the lightest edge of some cycle in G, then every MHT of G should include E. This is false. We may need to skip that edge due to creating cycle. Let's take an example. There are four vertices and six edges. Now in A, C, D cycle, here weight is 5, weight is 4, weight is 3. If we will create menu spanning tree, first we will include A, B, weight is 1, next B, C, weight is 2, next C, D, weight is 4. We will exclude weight 3. So this weight 3 is the lightest weight of A, C, D cycle, but we are excluding it. We are not including it in menu spanning tree. So this is false. AC is the lightest edge of ACD cycle but we are not including it as it is creating cycle. So every lightest weight of the cycle need not necessary to include in the MHT. We may exclude it. So that's why statement 1 is false. Next statement 2. If E is the heaviest edge of some cycle in G then every MHT of G exclude E. This is true. If it is the heaviest edge in a cycle, then we will exclude that. So we can have other choice of low cost edge. So we can exclude the heaviest edge. This is the case in distinct weight. And this is true for each edge have distinct weight. If each edge are not distinct, then a minimum spanning tree have equal highest weight. And we may need to include that E and we may exclude other one. Suppose this weight is also 3. Now in this cycle A, B, C, we may include these 3 A, C and we may exclude B, C. Suppose this is E, then we may include it if all weight are not distinct. But if all weight are distinct, then this is true. So we always exclude the heaviest weight if all weight are distinct. So we found statement 1 is false and statement 2 is true. So answer will be option B. It's not necessary that we will always include the lightest weight of the cycle and we will exclude the heaviest weight of the cycle every time if all weights are distinct. I already discussed minimum spanning tree. Just go through that and if this lecture is helpful for you, please like, share and subscribe. Thank you.